All right, we are back. This is episode 70. Took a uh, short break. Got distracted reading about a dozen Wikipedia articles, but uh, I am back now and obviously ready for some more Andromeda. Uh, so let's go ahead and do that quest with Reyes. Gotta turn my volume down there, it's getting a little loud. I guess that quest takes place right here in town. You look like you're waiting for someone. That's my line. Ugh. You want a drink or a room? Information, actually. That'll cost you more than a round of drinks. My friend's good for it. You still owe me for the last time. Fine, fine. It was just a joke. I've got a bottle of Elasa I'm willing to part with. What do you want to know? Zia Cordier. She been around recently? You mean your ex? Yeah, she was here. You never mentioned Zaya was your girlfriend. Uh, she's not. We drink together sometimes. I drink with a lot of people. Anyway. She was here? Yeah, met with a Solarian. Shifty guy I'd never seen before. Maybe it was the charlatan. Anything's possible. You overhear their conversation? They were planning to meet someone at Spirit's Ledge. Thanks, Umi. Whatever. You didn't hear it from me. If you check the meeting spot, I'll follow the collective lead. Doubt Zia was meeting the charlatan, but you never know. You know, really anybody could be the charlatan. He could be the charlatan, but I don't know why he would have this elaborate cover and still have time to run a vast semi-criminal organization. Why am I always stuck with the hard work? Because I'm the delicate one. Call me when you get to the meeting spot. All right, I guess we're going back out to the Badlands. And it is not that way. Why do these doors take so long to open? Yeah, I think that's pointing me towards the uh, elevator down to the slums. Let's just make sure there's nothing else to do here. Some shops, different places, companions. I think we're good to go. Um, you know, honestly, I probably should have crafted uh, a better version of the paw while I'm here. Yeah, let's do that real quick. Uh, hit escape. Oh, is it going to take me to the slums anyway? All right, well, if it does that, I'm just going to go ahead and do the quest. Yeah, that's OK. We'll go do it some other time. I don't feel like wasting any more time running around. And I think we've done everything here in the slums, so time to go back outside. In fact, can we look at the world map? No. I guess we have to go out here first. Yay, sunlight. Alright, so we have one quest over here. That cat quest. Um, this is where we can go back to uh, turn in that thing. Let's go ahead and do that now. Going to grab the Nomad first. Looks like I'll need the Summon Nomad button. There it is. Very convenient. Who needs Uber when you have that? And we won't be heading too far away. Oops. 
Pathfinder. This area can be mined for resources. Especially we considering we can uh, your mining interface. go over the water now. Yeah, I got a little bit of aluminum. Well, we're going fast here. I wonder if I have the stabilizers off. No, doesn't look like it. Just the speed. Alright, let's uh, try this shortcut here. Oh, I should have gotten some uh, more aluminum. Hopefully it is actually a shortcut. I was on a drive the other day and I saw a road called Shortcut Road. thought it might be a shortcut and uh, it added two minutes to my traveling time, so not living up to its name. That is the edge of the map. Alright, where are we? We need to turn around and make a hard left. Looks like this shortcut is the same way. In fact, I'm going to make a wider right turn here. And I guess we're going back this way. If we can go over the mountain. That might be a bit of a shortcut. Alright, here we go. Try to get some fuel back. Hey, we made it. Marker. And there's Knight's Hideout. Finally complete this quest. She's only been waiting a month. it's through that door downstairs. Ella, I put a little something together. This should help fix your implants. Are you serious? Yeah. Yeah, I can feel my nerves waking up. When Mercury goes down, Mum will lose her mind over this. Thank you. No problem, Ella. Sounds like he's saying like Ella. Like he's... Like it's a silent N. And silent eye. I've got to go. Thank you again. Uh, Mercury. Sounds like a code name for whatever Knight's doing. This will enable me to find any relevant data quickly. Let's search Knight's console and see what she's up to. All right. And that must be up here. Let's be quick. Security protocols breached. Bring up anything tagged Mercury. Files found. Mercury. A strike to prevent any future AI by destroying all quantum computers on the Nexus. Damn it. You could use those computers to create AI, but right now they run half the station. A lot of people could die. We need to stop Knight. Now. But quietly. Okay? So I have to go all the way back to the Nexus to advance this quest. Well, we'll do that later. For now, let's head over here next. And let's go to this one. Just because I've been to the other quick travel point a couple times now. Might as well go to something different. And look, there's the Nomad. Oh, and company. Maybe we can go around them. If we're sneaky. Hmm, got a codex entry. That's kind of interesting. Maybe it's the, uh, didn't I upgrade this thing fairly recently? Maybe that's what I'm 
feeling why it's going so fast. It definitely feels faster and thus harder to drive. We're going to run out of shuttles at this rate. Check for survivors. That might be one. Hello. Who? Who's there? Hamash, is that you? Don't talk. We'll get you back to town. No, I can't move. It... It's too late. I just... want to rest. He's not gonna make it. Can you tell me what happened? It... It was the cat. Took us by surprise. They killed everyone. John lasted the longest. They didn't know I was still alive. I saw them raiding our packs. Then they... They took off into the hills. Good to know, although... Usually people who aren't going to make it don't talk this clearly. What's in the hills? Is there a kept base there? There's nothing in the hills. I don't... We've never heard of a base. Sloan says Kadara is free of Kets. <laughs> what did the Ket take from you? I... I don't know. Supplies. Weapons. Scaven ship parts. I'll leave you to rest. Thank you. I... I wish... Kytus, it's Ryder. Your cat rumors have weight. Just found a caravan they attacked. Damn it. Really thought we got them all. One of the wounded said they headed for the hills. I'm gonna check it out. I'll search too. Grabbing a shuttle now. Well, that's kinda sad. Actually, he doesn't look dead yet, but... I feel bad leaving him. But, that's the game. I guess if he lived and went back, then he could tell others that they're a cat, and that would kinda of be the purpose of the mission. See, that would be a kind of an interesting choice if you had to choose whether to trust him to bring him back and that he won't say anything or uh, you could have the option of killing him yourself is there going to be an ambush here or something another dead Angara scan for cat tracks oh I see him cat tracks they're leading up into those hills Yep, straight ahead. We got targets. Yeah, I see. Well, that was cool. I'll have to remember that, which means I probably won't. All right, back in the Nomad. Oh, I never scanned a thing. Cat tracks. We're going the right way. It's kind of a cool idea, though. Using their footprints to uh, figure out where they're hiding. Pathfinder, this area can be mine. Don't know why I'm using a scanner. I think you I could just use my eyes to figure out which way interface. footprints are pointing. Didn't get too much aluminum from that one. This technology is not registered to either of Kudara's factions, Pathfinder. Let's be cat. More tracks. Can't be far now. Oops. Hey, look, cat. And minerals. Let's back up a bit. I do like my rocks. Cast Raiders. Those aren't cat. Whoa, he went flying. Oh, uh, and we got one of those animals aggroed. I don't think he likes me. <laughs> I'm 
Well, those Death. were not cut. It's an outdoor weapon cache here, Pathfinder. I recommend scanning. It says here this weapon cache is headed for a specific camp. Sam? With more information, I can determine the source of the transmissions. <sighs> Guess I just scan everything here and figure out what this is about. Oh, is this one of the ones where I have to find more camps to do stuff? Maybe. Because I don't see a quest marker there. Alright, well, if it happens, it happens. If it doesn't, I won't shed any tears. What is that thing? Oh, my mining node. Alright, where are these cats? Straight ahead. Pathfinder, this area can be mined for us. You don't say. See that cave? Good spot for a hideout. Bet the cat are inside. Good eyes. Titus, I think I found something. Sending the nav point. This isn't the monolith cave, is it? I don't think so. Nope. Totally different. Impatient, are we? Sloan. I wasn't expecting you. She wouldn't take no for an answer. I'm not about to let someone else fight my battles. Especially an initiative lapdog. You were happy enough to have this lapdog track down information for you? That's what dogs do. Fetch. Enough. Let's get this over with. You're such a grump when you're worried. Every second you're gone from the port is an opportunity for the Collective. Pathfinder and I can have. What was that? They know we're here. Get ready. Her eyes are different colors. Didn't notice that before. There's a term for it, but I can't think of it at the moment. That is not my weapon. Hey, look, Ted. Long time to see. That was some spit. Plenty more up there. We got some range too. Here we go. You get in a uh, singularity range. That should do it. You guys are the ones getting flanked. Made, watch out. There he is. I think he's the last one. Yep. Hey, another 5%. I guess because this is like a, a main quest, quote unquote. Very nice. And there's some more ammo. Should I talk to you guys anymore? Are you done? Let me grab these remains. I guess now she can say she did take care of all the cat. Let's get rid of the bodies. Wouldn't want anyone to know you had cat hiding under your noses. Your discretion is appreciated. She's, uh, her voice actress was in other Byro games. Maybe Swotor? Definitely recognize it. Alright, well that checks off that one. And, uh, whatever you guys want to do. He wanted to meet somewhere out here, right? What's this? Plant samples. Alright. Long story short, we have a big area yet to explore. 
So let's fast travel back there and get started, shall we? Frame rate drop there. I think we're okay now. Wrong mode. I also get the feeling we'll be fighting an architect here at some point. Not here, here, but somewhere on Dara. There's a cache close by. Yes, very close by. Probably on top of this thing. Or inside this thing. I don't see anything in here. I see a terminal. Security override. I'll let you guys read that. Probably the story of the people who lived here. Giving some flavor to the world. Looks like the container is above us. So how do we get up there? See, I can get up there with a the jetpack, but how do the people... Oh, I see. I say people who lived here probably didn't have jetpacks. But I do see the stairs now. Locked. Hmm. Oh, wasn't there a security code thing? That doesn't help me get inside of it. Hmm. I climb up here this way. Look like it. What if I go over here? Nope, just going to bump my head. <gasps> See, I read everything on the terminals, so I don't know what I'm missing. Like, if there's a way to open the door, I should be able to open the door. Hmm. Well, let's head back inside one more time and check. Otherwise, I'm not going to waste too much time on this. Oh, I have to do that. And now it should be open. I get the feeling there might be people in there as well. Don't see any bodies around. Yep, there they are. Been hiding from those outcast bastards for three days now. They're pulling out all the stops to get their credits back. I haven't eaten in days. So thirsty. Fuck it. I know it should be filtered, but I'm taking my chances. Water is water. Oh, God. This... <coughs> yeah, no, water is not water. Looks like he was doubting the story. Um, aha. That must be the cache. Alright, that's pretty cool. Yes, it was. So I guess you can kind of find this one by this little mini quest anyway. But at least uh, having the container mark tells you there's something more to find here. Nice little detour. But time to go back to the main attraction. See, so yeah, we have a quest here, and we have a plant sample straight ahead. Sounds fun. Let me just double check. Yep, going the right way. 
Here we go. Andromeda plant sample detected nearby. Purple thing, maybe? Yep. Doesn't look edible, but I will trust my scanner. And let's go ahead and see what this new quest is. Somebody's alive in there. They don't mind the company. Some exiles. Why did they keep appearing? Greetings. Error. That interaction is not understood. Report logged. That's weird. Strategic approach to destroy the enemy's command structure and military forces. More information is required. Counterforce targeting is a strategic approach to destroy the enemy's command structure and military forces. More information is required. What's happening here? Who are you? Is this your data pad? Are you one of them? Who are you afraid of? Who is them? Whoever's behind all this. Everyone's acting crazy, spouting all that nonsense. I can't remember how it started. I'm not even sure how I got here. What do you mean? Nobody's in their right mind. And there are these people, others. They showed up and they left this data pad. Ugh. The others, them, this really sounds like Lost. What did these people want? If I knew, I wouldn't be asking you. I heard one of them say, we left the data pad behind. Ugh. I'm... I'm fine now. I'm sorry to trouble you. It was nothing. Be seeing you. Doesn't seem like nothing, but... There's gotta be something going on with that data pad. The Krogan and Asari show no signs of neural disruption. Their patterns remain in entrained. The Solarian shows signs of some resistance, with occasional breaks in pattern. You'll likely need to adjust for Solarian physiology. To be on the safe side, entry code is rotated to 9XA2. They exhibit unusual brain activity. An outside signal is affecting their thought process. What can we do for them? Nothing immediate, though if you scan others, I may be able to locate the source of the signal. Deviance describes the behaviors or characteristics that violate society. Well, that's all of them. Further examination will be necessary. So where's this signal? Not too far away by the looks of it. Let's do this! I think I just ran over some wildlife. supposed to be in here scientist probably not the good kind what the hell are you doing to those people out there it's an experiment physically no harm has come to them they're fine you're doing all this on purpose are you insane we've been called worse back home we used to work for an organization called Cerberus until our boss Not decided surprised. we'd rather spend money on truly crazy ideas like bringing back people from the dead. <laughs> Project Lazarus. Pure voodoo. But in Andromeda, we're our own masters. And what you saw out there, it's the birth of something amazing. A biological network. A host of minds all linked together. Connected. We're harnessing the power of consciousness to create a new kind of supercomputer. Yeah, I don't think that can go well. Funny, I met a woman named Catherine Nye. She was fighting against the sort of thing you're doing here. We know about her. She got caught up in a Cerberus project back home. Overlord. Gavin Archer and that bunch. Good idea. Poor execution. This will be different. What is Cerberus about? Purity. 
We think humanity should chart its own course, free of alien laws or the morality designed to hold us back. Our boss was straying from the path, lost his focus. He and that Lawson woman were recruiting all the wrong people, friends in low places. Andromeda is a chance for a do-over. Humanity should call the shots here. The rest can follow our lead. What exactly is this experiment doing to those people out there? The right energy focused at the right frequency can entrain a person's consciousness. The mind is ultimately just electromagnetic patterns. You mean mind control? Those people were banished. They're criminals. They were using their minds to make trouble anyway. We thought we'd make better use. And now, by linking them together, they're like a living computer, but working at the speed of thought, similar to the computer you've got in your head. What are you doing on Kadara? The Badlands is a perfect place to do the work that needs to be done. Must be done. Against all these new threats in Andromeda, it's vital we find an edge for humanity. Enough of this. Sam? I've located the control for the signal. It will shut the experiment down. We can't stop you, Let's but those it. people depend on the signal now. Their minds need it to function. Oh. Leave them be. Well, I'm hoping that's not the case. How do we shut this experiment down, Sam? I can tune the signal against the scientists as punishment, freeing the people. The victims will likely suffer complications as a result. Or I can alter the nature of the signal to ease the victim's predicament, unlock the system from further changes. Or I could just walk away and do nothing. Alright, three choices here, although I think the uh, right choice is pretty obvious. It would be a little more difficult if you could only save the people by harming the scientists, but I don't think that would make a lot of logical sense as far as mechanics go. Interesting that these are like question mark things though and not actual choices. Change the signal. Try to make things easier on those people. You ruined it. Those people are no good to us now. Glad I could go. Now go back and crawl under the rock you came from. All right, I think they got off kind of easy. But uh at least there were some fun Mass Effect 2 references there. Okay, so what's left? We have another forward station. We uh, have to do Reyes's quest, and what is this? Oh, this is a quest from a while back. We'll finish that one too. But those will wait until next time, because I'm going to end this episode here, and I will see you guys then.